All right, hello, and welcome to this very first playthrough of Final Fantasy VII Rebirth. Last time we completed Chapter 9, The Planet Stirs, and now we are going to start Chapter 10, which is apparently called Watcher of the Veil. Veil, V-A-L-E, that's an interesting... I would, cons I would figure it would be V-E-I-L... But no, it's not. Anyway. Okay, folks, we're here. We've met Sid. He seems like Sid would be. Oh, Yuffie doesn't like flying either, huh? God, it sucks for Sucks to suck, Yuffie. Brought you as far as I could. Hope y'all don't mind walking, cause now you're on your own. What about the next time we need a lift? Hmm. Send up a signal. Just make sure I got room to land. Happy trails to ya. I know that voice. I don't know from where. So I guess Sid's not joining the party yet. Unless this plane crashes or something. The veil's this way. The veil. Okay. Is that another name for Cosmo Canyon? Expect the telephone booth at an airship to turn up smoke signal call upon the tiny Bronco. After alighting, the pilot will happily fly you to any airstrip you visited before for the right price, of course. That right price will be a thousand gil for your inaugural trip and three hundred for gil for subsequent flights. Well, I already paid a thousand, so. Yeah. Am I gonna have to pay that again? All right, so wait, Bahamut? Oh shit! No, we're not doing that. We're not doing that right now. We are going to further streamline our playthrough. Um, really, the only extra thing we are doing besides going straight for main story stuff is Queen's Blood. That's it. That's it. I'm not doing anything else. Yeah, I, I mean. Even in a game like this, I have my limits, man. We've already sunk over 40 hours into this game, and don't get me wrong, this is one of the best games I've ever played. This is a top 10 all-time game, almost certainly. But, uh... Even with the very best games I ever played, Elden Ring, Sekiro, Resident Evil 4 Remake, Last of Us 2... Not Last of Us 2, actually. That's the only one, probably. But, but that game doesn't have a ton of side content. As far as, like, my favorite games with side content, El with a lot of side content, Elden Ring, Resident Evil 4, had a surprising amount of side content. Um, Sekiro. We hit this point eventually, and, and we are deep into this game now, so... Where are we going? Nope, I'm not. I'm not doing anything that's not going to the objective. Where is the objective? Why does it say we're at our destination? It doesn't make any sense. Alright, I guess we're going up this way. Nope, we're not even doing caches anymore. I am really excited to see Cosmo Canyon though. Of all of the... Of all of the... Places that I thought about wanting to see... In this game, in Prospect... I think Cosmo Canyon was the first one that popped into my head. Not Mount Corel... Well, in the Gold Saucer, I guess. That might have been first. Oh, uh, Tifa, you have a weapon skill you need to learn, right? Oh, maybe, no you don't. Does anyone have a weapon skill they need to learn? Yuffie. Oh, that's right, Yuffie just got a weapon. 
It was a pretty good one, too. And the skill sounded good, too. I don't remember what it was, but... We're not even doing Remnant Wave Towers. Nope. Not even when we have to walk right by it. Oh yeah, Doppelganger. Do it in a single battle? Maybe. Nuh uh, she says. Nuh uh. Your... No, nope. we're just doing doppelganger over and over again. There it is, weapon ability master. Now you can do your limit. Oh, it's over. All right. And yes, I'm still sick as a motherfucking dog, so I apologize for all of that in advance. My voice, the sniffles, the sneezing, the nose blowing. It's a whole thing. But I, I'm pretty good about muting when I need to mute. And going, uh, putting up my BRB screen when I absolutely have to. What? Usually when I have to blow my nose, which is not that often. <laughs> No, nope, we're not doing Chocobo Ranches anymore. What? Excuse me? Chadley, no, we're not interested, sir. Oh, you know what? I need to s fucking transmute some more mixed potion or I'm sorry not mixed mist ooh I need craftsmanship 10 and I get higher craftsmanship there it goes Anybody else weapon level 5 yet? Yes. You know what? I'm going to hold on to them. Until I feel like I need them. That's stupid, right? I should spend them. I should spend them. ATB recharge rate. That's good. Boy, those things don't last long. This up, this high up, I guess.
applies protect entering battle. Okay. Oh, damn it. That's what I really want. Oh, don't forget, you can uh, refund stuff, too. Interested. Don't make eye contact with Chadley, anyone, everyone. He's gonna rope us into some bullshit. to get a chocobo to like Shawnee that you Shawnee Who's Shawnee one of your chocobos <laughs> my apologies <laughs> so Shawnee's your bird goodness no Shawnee she's a chocobo Jackie or since then she's completely lost I see oh tell me you kids any good at Yeah. Wonderful. In that case, I had everything built brand new. Just someone ought to put it to good use, don't you think? I don't know. Ever run a ring course? I reckon you won't find a course. Whoa! That sounds amazing. <laughs> you want Sure. But first, you'll need to catch yourself a chocobo. Go ahead and ride her over to the training. Twisting paths and bewildering brushlands. She'll guide you through it all with ease. We gotta go get a chocobo. Okay, so how do I... Welcome! Feel free to have a look at our wares. Shut up, dude. <laughs> oh, Cosmo Canyon. I am still doing Queen's Blood games, so I bet there's some of those in Cosmo Canyon. I just bet. Should I try and get the Chocobo? Oh. 
Look at that little baby. Yeah, just because it'll make things faster if we do. right at me. God damn it. Grab him! How the fuck was I supposed to? How am I going to do this? <coughs> Pull it, motherfucker. supposed to do this. <coughs> Grab it, Cloud. God bless, you're so fucking slow.
Oh, sorry, I didn't realize I was muted. My bad. I don't think I said anything interesting, probably. Just the usual shit. Alright. Easy, girl. We got you. You're ours now. You're a labor animal now. The birds that fail at fearless and can leap from certain ledges to fly across the region's steep chasms. While on Chocoback, take flight from gliding ranges marked with and ride the generator's air currents to access hard to reach locations. Okay. Right. Just Sounds good. You don't get sick. Chocoback. Amazing, isn't it? It's like my Chocobo and I share one mind, one body, one soul. Uh -huh. Or maybe my body just hates Shinra cars, trains, and boats. They ought to find a way to make the ride smoother for this stuff. Put R work. I think they got other priorities. No, we're not digging up shit anymore. Why, why can't I? Why can't I use this? Do I have to unlock it or something? No. Cosmo Canyon, this way, all right. Hey, look at that. There it is. A sacred sanctuary where the planet's greatest minds gather. It's beautiful. More than I ever imagined. Come on, let's pick up the pace. I can hear it calling my name. Yeah, me too. You're going to get the Cosmo Canyon music? Come on. The other music cut out. Give us the Cosmo Canyon music. I can already hear it in my head. Or... I don't really remember how it goes, but I remember the vibe of it. Do 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 do. Wasn't it something like that? Do 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 do. Do 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 do. Do 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 do. Isn't some that that's how it goes, right? Do do do. Wait, what was his voice all about? <laughs> we were so worried. <laughs> why does red sound like a child suddenly? Now, why don't you go pay your respects to fellow Bugenhagen? Come on. Bugenhagen. I always wondered how that was pronounced. 
I was I think I said Bugenhagen. Bugenhagen. Let them through. They're good people. I promise. After all, they're the reason I'm here. What's up with Red's voice? What in the hell was that? What in the hell was that? Hey guys, it's me. Who? <laughs> He's such a softy. Real quick, gotta check something. Yes, we have weapons. An All kinds of weapons. Dropped these on us this morning. Wanted posters of the terrorists who bombed those reactors. Oh, but they changed the photos, right? Kate Sith changed him. But I think we can say you had nothing to do with all that. Even if Nanaki hadn't vouched for you, it's obvious. <sighs> Welcome to the Sanctum of Planetology. Call good job, Kate. Gonna be some good... Y'all play Queen's Blood here? Just kidding, I know you do. Didn't Red very briefly... I think Red very briefly spoke with that voice earlier in the game, and I thought I, like, misheard it. But, uh, nope. Nanaki. That's his name. Must be that way for a reason. Tell him, Kate Sith. Tell him you did it. Oh, there goes Red. Okay, all right. Just so we're clear. I'm gonna guess that this is the first time. I've missed a weapon. Let's find out. Ah! Two! I've missed two weapons. And I have just enough to purchase both of them. Oh, man. Right, we're buying these. Road Warrior Bangles. I'm gonna need some of those at some point. What do we just buy for Red and for uh, Kate? No. That was close. the vengeance gauge to heal allies potency proportion proportional to amount expended that's interesting Iron megaphone. When did that? When did I get that? Deal damage, great or small, or perhaps just get your fortune told. All right. Well, we got a fucking. It doesn't have any materia spots. All right. Let's max these things out, and then we'll fucking. Well, I don't really use his materia that much. All right, so Kate needs to be in the party, and so does Red. You dare use my weapons for it? <clears throat> oh, Red! I Red! I can't! I can't put Red. Unsavory. Oh no! I don't have any more money for. Queen's Bloods card. Oh no, and I need it. Oh, I've got enough, I've got enough. Did you find 
Everything. Let's look at those cards. Anything I can use? Place an ally and lower the power of ally to enemy cards on tiles by replace power. Right? Oh, that's interesting. I don't know if I'm good enough to use that, though. Destroy enemy cards on affected tiles. Mm, it's too expensive. Sephiroth. We knew about Malboro. Uh, that's an interesting card. I would say we could use that instead of... Uh, Instead of a security officer, maybe? Alright. Well, we're out of money for the first time in the whole game. Why do you talk with a different voice suddenly, huh? I was born and raised here, in this canyon. I was to become a Watcher of the Veil like those before me, until I was taken by Shinra. Now that I'm home and have repaid my debt to you, I plan to serve my village once more. I appreciate all that you've done for me. Oh, Thank we you. know you're sticking with us, Red. Come on. I'm gonna miss you, Red. Oh, don't say that. You're only making this harder. This that's weird. I mean, I wish we had more time, but this is my duty. I suppose it was your duty to act the old man. I wanted you to treat me as an equal, not a dog. Not a pig. Is that you, my boy? Coming! So, was that goodbye? Nah, I'm sure we'll see him around the canyon. The real question is, why'd we come here? Queen's blood. Learn the secrets of planetology. Come on. Can't forget that materia. As for me. Ah, that will do. I'm just gonna take a nap right there on the steps, right? If you don't mind. Then we can see the sights. Okay. Oh, I see that Queen's Blood match. That's where we're going. interest in Queen's blood. It has bewitched you. That is true. It is only natural to hear it's called Queen's blood is of the planet and for the planet. Uh, okay, hippie, can we just play? Every card holds within it a greater purpose. One that be come. Join me in a match. Okay, I'm gonna mop the floor with your ass. Raise power of allied and enemy cards on affected tiles by four. 
Oh, when enhanced. God damn. Um, all right. Ugh. Uh, let's get rid of this, and this, and this. Destroy your ass, bitch. I mean, right? Watch this. Watch the power of my cards go up right now. I had 20 at first, right? <laughs> Get wrecked. That's a good card, that Loveless card. That's a good card. For this deck, it's a good card for this deck. Kadena, fuck off, you hippie. I could probably use that card. The only thing I don't like about it is it doesn't build forward. A strange, wicked The game's pleasures belong the thorns beneath. That will bleed you. Many devotees Does, uh, have succumbed. Remember. Chadley, do you have something to tell me after this lady's done talking? Yes, good. Congratulations. You have attained the rank of Bloodcat. As such, allow me to brief you on another promising player. An advanced Queen's Blood AI named Wise can be found in the Dust Bowl. I suspect it might prove a worthy opponent. All right. Let me let me finish up with these guys here, and then we'll go there. Red, we don't care what Red's doing right now. Good day, ladies 
and gentlemen. <sighs> Should I use that card that I got? I don't think I'm going to. I'm happy with my deck the way it is. I'm trouncing these motherfuckers. You supposed to be talking right now? It's our very first hello, sir. Could this well? I spy a row. You might be the QB killer, but there's only one. That's right. Our up to up thing. Shut up, shut up, shut up. And first and feeble, lower, yeah, I'm not gonna use that. Um let's get rid of these. That's better. Dumb not to play on the bottom, man. There you go. Well, yeah. Let me think for a second. Let's just try and get some real estate. We're floundering a little bit here. Now you've got a choice. Okay. Uh and that was my only real wall play. I need something to damn it. Ah fuck. Alright. Sorry. We're gonna win that pretty sure anyway. Alright, this guy's gonna go here, obviously. And then we'll put this guy here. Oh you're not you're not done yet? Oh shit, okay. Alright, well we definitely won though, right? Oh, he's fucking Running up the score on my ass. Am I gonna lose? I'm gonna. F oh no, I'm not. But it was close. Those replacement cards. I'm. I'm sleeping on those. Cause you can keep playing. It's just a question of how much more you. Damage you can do with them, I guess. About carnage, am I right? I'm lucky I got out of that match with he made a shut up. something Shh. tells better starts. Congratulations, though we found stay tuned because we've got more coming your way. Alright, um are we able to uh fast travel? Was that Queen's Blood match? It should be Corral present somewhere, right? No, we already defeated him. Oh, there it is. Are we not able to, um, fast travel? Fast travel is currently unavailable. God damn it. Alright, well, we'll do it later.
How did we catch up with you, Red? It was him, wasn't it? Oh yeah, he's got his little orb that he's balanced on and everything. Look at that. Oh, these are the friends I was talking about. He looks just like the fucking original game, doesn't he? For looking after my monkey. My name is Wolkenhagen. I teach planetology here in the canyon. And one could say I know a thing or two about our world. A thing or two? I doubt there's a thing or two you don't know about it. <laughs> Well, it might seem that way to a child like yourself. I'm not a child anymore. I'm 48. 40 what? <laughs> <laughs> Nanaki here has a long life ahead of him. In human terms, I would say he's about 15 or 16 years old. That's more than old enough. I can protect our veil and everyone in it. Which is more than I can say for my good-for-nothing father. Don't be so hard on him, you're gonna regret it later. Speaking of the members of our little community, have you announced your return to one and all, Mamaki? Not yet. Be right back. Hmm. <laughs> but where are my manners? Please, come in and have a look around. <laughs> Bugenhagen. Never would have pronounced it that way. <laughs> what up with all these books? Those devices are testing the pull of gravity. <laughs> Do you recognize that little scamp? I'll have you know that in his childhood... Was he missing an eye was quite in his childhood, too? I always assumed that was because of Hojo. He's definitely missing an eye in that project projection. How did he lose his eye? That is one of the first Marco detectors ever built. Hmm. Though I suspect it can't detect much now. Right there is a type of a current generator. It harnesses the power of the wind to produce new airflows of its own. Perhaps you've encountered them before during your travels. Uh, have we? Have we? Oh, doesn't look familiar. We're gonna rob your old ass. Just hang out there for a little bit. Clean up all your venisons. You won't find a larger telescope on the planet. With it, you can see to the edge of the galaxy. Oh, it's like, what's a galaxy? But the lens could do with some cleaning. My apologies. Okay, so now what? Observe here have traveled to us from the far reaches of time and space. 
That weapon? The planet crying out. A sorrowful dirge indeed. One I've heard all too often of late. This tubing allows us on the surface to hear the inner voice of the planet. What we just heard didn't come from the planet, though. That was definitely the voice of a weapon. Hmm. You seem awfully sure of yourself, miss. Because we saw them. With our own eyes. Two, in the Corel and Gungaga reactors. They were loud and huge. <laughs> A fascinating account. Were it true. However, such grand delusions could be a sign of Marco poisoning. To see oh man, you don't even know. Um, excuse me? Oh, oh. Yes. That would do them some good. <laughs> Judging from everything you've said, the three of you are unfamiliar with basic planetology. But it is never too late to learn. Please, come with me. This is a really fucking cool cutscene in the original. Present to you our planetarium. Final Fantasy VII, the original, features the latest iteration. It's one of the very few games that I didn't play much of, but I knew a lot about because I watched multiple people play all the way through it. So, I even though I didn't play this, even though I didn't see this part myself until two years ago. I saw it when I was 15, 14 or 15, watching somebody else play it. And it was fucking cool. Oh, we're doing a full cutscene, an actual cutscene for this. Good. They're taking it seriously. I guess in the pre-rendered cutscenes they can just put a little bit more detail so you can you can tell. Rather, it is a quest to comprehend the cyclical nature of life. Behold, the planet we call home. It was from its soil, so teeming with life, that mankind was born. And like all living things, man is fated to die. So, what happens next? All man? The body withers and returns to the planet. But what of the mind, the spirit, the soul? Much like its former vessel, it too returns whence it came. Great river where all intertwine and circle the planet without end. A cycle of continuous convergence and divergence. The ceaseless ebb and flow that is the life stream. They haven't talked much about On the life stream. Day, though it is as much a reservoir as it is a stream, being the sum of the planet's spiritual energy. They talk a lot about Mako, but do they even know about the life stream? Aerith does. The blood coursing through its planet. They know about it. They know about it, right? And if ever that essence were to be entirely depleted.
course. These are but basic principles of planetology. So you're saying that Mako is spiritual energy, which we're using up? Just so. Siphoned from the planet and processed for industry. That energy can no longer fulfill its true purpose. It is fated to fuel man's machinery, then fade away. Okay, but does it actually fade away? I mean, what if it doesn't? What if it just returns to the life stream in a different form? Is that possible? A novel theory, suggestive of a lack of understanding. Hmm. However, that can be overcome with time and education. You rang? Please escort this young lady to our seminar room, would you? Right this way. Okay. Hey, can I come? Okay, can I come? Wait, what am I supposed to do now? Participate in the seminar. And why does the... Why does the destination thing say I need to go down, not up? The lights we observe here have traveled to us from the Huh? Is to gaze into their past. What they once were. Eons ago. Did they not go up? Did they go down? Okay. I'm confused. Okay, hold on. Where's Where's Bugenhagen? No. No, 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 no. <sighs> Where's Bugenhagen? We'll start there. How the fuck do you get off? Out? Okay, here we go. All right, Bugenhagen. With your silly ass name, where are you? What? The stars have taught us countless lessons of we have all been worried sick about Nautiki, fellow Bugenhagen chiefly among us. Oh, for fuck's sake, I have no idea where to go. Thanks so much for taking such great care of Nanaki. Who the fuck are you? Hagen instructed me to let you take anything you think might prove. Check out the storeroom when you have a chance. Okay. I'm following you, bro. Children to join hands and together. For united, we shall never fear of 
Alright, I'm done in here, sir. Oh, no, I am not. Whose weapon is this going to be? Barret? Oh. Three weapons he's gotta get through now. Says I need to go down. Maybe Tifa and Aerith walked down and I just miss it read the scenario. It must be that. is lame. Did you know none of the materia here is even real? And don't get me started on the planetologists. Bunch of blowhards in love with the sound of their own voice. Ever keeping okay. People everywhere resolve to not take her back. Sorry that you feel that way. Within you all, are the planet's lost. And memories by unlocking this knowledge. I heard from fellow Bugenhagen. By all means, follow me if you would. Oh, okay. Which would you say is a more worthy pursuit? I ask you this. Who among you has looked in to the universe? So many seminars. Where do I get A seminar is in progress. These I've uh, always been on the bigger side, but... I've never been into physical stuff. Painting and poetry are more my thing. My old man, he... he... It's like an AA meeting. What about you, miss? You must have a story to share. Please. Me? Uh, okay. I, uh... Where to begin? I fell into the life stream. I don't have words to describe it, except beautiful, maybe? It was a lot to take in. This Feelings lady's full of shit. washed over me. Long forgotten memories came flooding back. It was a warm, comforting place. But there was also conflict. A war between the planet and its enemies. And I can't... I mean, we can't let them win. We need the planet, and it needs us. We have to rise up, fight back, defend it from this terrible threat. Thing is, I don't know how to do any of that. And I hoped you might have the answer. <laughs> I'm not criticizing planetology or anything, and I'm not trying to scare anybody either. I just... You know... <sighs> Never mind. This is all coming out wrong. <laughs> Please, do not be discouraged. Should you ever wish to try again, we would be more than happy to listen. What matters is that you keep challenging your beliefs. Stop doing that, and the answers will forever elude you. On that note, I think we should adjourn for the evening. The River of Lights is almost upon us, so let us head to the torch.
See you at the festival. She looked like she could use a hug, Cloud. You fucking weirdo. Alright, let's rob these motherfuckers. Um... This whole planetology thing, I never never sounded like a cult in the original game. Definitely gets that gives you that feeling in this one. D is it just me? I doubt it. God damn it, where do I go? Oh, does this elevator go down? I thought this was the one that went up. Torch elevator, it's a different elevator. Like a souls like suddenly in this elevator. What are we looking at? Look at them, gathered around the fire, just like us that day. Who the fuck are you and what'd you do with Red? If only we could do that again. Uh, never mind. Just forget I said anything. I'll lend an ear. Don't give me that bullshit. My mom, my chest swells with so much pride, I, I feel like it'll burst. But when it comes to my dad, I just... Sorry, I can't. Still not ready. Sorry, I can't. Still not ready. I had the pleasure of talking to a mentor. Said it was presumptuous of me to think I could save the planet. She decides her own fate, you see. As rain cleanses the skies, so too does she... So planetologists don't herself. think that the so Earth is in danger. sit here and theorize while the planet rinses and repeats? What do you want to do? Not nothing. That's for damn sure. At the same time, though, I don't know if fighting's the answer anymore. Maybe it's time for some good old-fashioned introspection. All right, let's all take peyote, dance around this thing until fucking dawn, and I'm sure we'll feel very different about this whole adventure when we're done. Did I sound as awkward as I felt? Yes. Felt for you. Never been that good with words, as you know. We're just two peas in a pod, aren't we? Ah, shit. That was the wrong answer. Look at those stars. Nope. Nope. Eh, can't take that one back. Yuffie! Where's Kate? Oh, there he is. Kate, you don't have anything to say? When you die, I guess you don't have a relationship with Kate Sith. That has literally got to be the dumbest thing I have ever Once you die, that's... Why do you think that? Why do you think that? I just do. I believe in anything else until I see some actual proof. Well, I mean, can it be this? both? Doesn't mean you're going to be conscious when you're in the live stream. Some say we're like grains of sand on the beach of the universe. Then what do you think Yuff, uh, Yuffie? What do you think Mako is then? Just oil? I guess that could be. She could think that. Oh, they're gonna burn Aerith? Oh no. She's not a witch, guys! 
She's not a witch. What is this? Did you agree to marry somebody here or some shit? What is this? What are you doing? Who gave you this responsibility? They like clapping here. So, I'm an ancient, as in a steward of the planet. One of those ancients. What? Nobody's gonna believe that, Earth. Or, to be more precise, the only ancient. For the most part, it's been a source of pain. I've been held against my will. I've been watched. I've been ignored. Even hated. And it's been that way ever since I was little. My blood's been nothing but a curse. If I ever started to forget, something would remind me of what I was and bring me crashing back down to Earth. It was always the same. Time after time. I'd be shown a glimmer of hope, only to have it snatched away. I was never gonna be normal. That much was clear. You shouldn't be telling all these people this, Eris. Get her! She's the last age you get her! Oh god, Cloud! You can do fucking better than that! Jesus! I was like, smile? That's gotta be the best option. He never does that. It's also been a blessing. It's brought some wonderful people into my life. Friends that I love. Jesus Christ, Cloud. And for once, I think I'm okay. Happy, even. And all that pain feels worth it. Even if I can't lead a normal life, there is one thing I can do. Return their kindness. And try to make the most of what I've been given. Good job, Aerith. Now, where's the peyote? Are we not? Are we skipping the peyote part? Bummer. It's not that kind of party, I guess. chapter is this? 10? What was the name of the chapter? Something of the Veil? Watcher of the Veil. Got my thumbnail pulled up here. There! It is time! <sighs> Whoa! Huh? God damn it, Cloud. Say something. God damn you. Cloud is the fucking worst. He is the worst. God damn it. So. 
This is where you've been, Nanaki. What's up? There's something of great import I need to show oh, you. Oops. And by that I mean more of you. Join me, would you? What did you all think of the River of Light? For whatever reason, the ceremony has drawn a number of tourists to the Vale as of late. When I ask for their impressions, they often speak of how beautiful it was. Some claim they were even moved to tears. It's an overwhelmingly positive reception, I'm happy to say. To stir the human soul is no small feat. And it pleases me to know that the River of Lights possesses such power. Alas, my hopes to parlay their emotional response into a deeper intellectual curiosity. They have yet to be fulfilled. People are surrounded by cats, dogs, birds, and trees. They know I'm not. that life is all around them. Be it that sounds the horrible. birth of a baby or the blooming of a flower. They bear constant witness to the blessed cycle of creation. Yet they've no interest in the welfare of our planet. <laughs> Forgive me for sharing my idle thoughts. Keeping them to my Where can I get one of those ball uh ball uh segues, man? That thing's pretty cool. This door was sealed so that none may enter. Why, yes, and by my own hand, no less. However, you've a trial to undertake. I do? If you wish to prove yourself and become a watcher of the veil, that is. I presume you are prepared. We got time for this? Yeah, yeah we can play for another. I will also so. require your assistance in carrying out the trial. Much what, danger why? awaits within, and I wish to ensure his safety. When you're ready, simply say the word. Ready. Then off we go. Oh, this is level 36. We're under leveled. We are officially not doing enough. Now we follow the cave where it leads, deep as it will take us. Mm. Little bitch. Mm. Better hurry. came under attack my mother fought with courage with honor she faced the enemy and laid down her life to save us my father though he turned tail and ran he was a coward so then you still haven't forgiven him why would i i see About to feel real dumb, Red. So maybe that's during that attack, that's when he lost his eye, maybe? From this point onward, only two may proceed. He who shall undertake the trial and his observer. Who's gonna observe? I'll do it. Oh, 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 oh. Oh, that would render the trial meaningless. Oh, oh. But if not him. Ah, you do nicely. Me? Him? Really? At least pretend not to hate me. Oh, oh, oh. 
Whenever you're ready. ready. This red doesn't like Barrett that much. You gonna watch my back? Yeah. Burning holes in you right now. <laughs> what is this? This is a place of deep sorrow. A place where those who have been in the trials, can we just run around the enemies? Oh, no. Need hog. Those things wishes they were. Those things wish they were need hog. Approach glowing surfaces and use left stick to scamper along walls. Stop moving or press circle to drop. But remember, watch where you land. Uh. Okay. Triangle. Uh, okay. Hmm. How did you get around that, Barrett? Your discomfort is only natural. A fierce battle was waged here. And even after 45 years, scars remain fresh. What? You're saying the Gi managed to make it all the way up here? <laughs> okay, somebody fill me in. Who are the Gi? The tribe knows a very few people outside of the Vale. The rest you will learn in due time. In fact, you can be certain. Hey. Is Red gonna have this goofy ass fucking voice the rest of the game? Because I'm not down with it. I like his other voice. He sounds so noble and wise. Now he sounds like fucking. Roche. <laughs> it's not just his voice that's different, it's his whole tone and demeanor and vibe. Did I do good or did I do good? Red wouldn't say that fucking shit. He'd be like, mm, Yes, all is all is as it should be. Say say something cool like that. Missed Mega Potion. Don't mind if I do. That's a good get. Fear me! Fear me! Fear me. Oh, 
Only got two legs here, you know. Red's voice. I hate this new voice. I hate it. Look at all that. Look at all those mega potions I just got. Glad I went over there. You want? Hey, where'd you run off to? I'm right here, bro. Relax. Gungaga Pine. Yeah, we know, Barrett. Relax. Oh, shit! We can take him. Here goes. Gotcha. Oh, shit, you have a new, another ability. Do you? No. Oh, shit. Uh, hey, ba Barrett, can you? I know you can do it. Forgot that Red had an ability he needs to learn. Oh yeah, deplete the vengeance gauge to heal potential allies, that's what it is. Alright. And we still got a way to go on that? Yeah, we just used it for the first time, I think. Where are we going? Oh, we're going down. Where A lot of good stuff down here. What is this shit? Is that an automaton? What the hell is that? That is a key. It's huge. <laughs> Under normal circumstances, I would stress that you mustn't judge a book by its cover. For the Gi, however, they are as fearsome as their appearance implies. These are the things that killed my mom? Nanaki, this shall be your first try. You are to explore this place. 
don't understand the nature of its history. Okay, we'll do. Press and hold L2 near an object to grab it with your mouth and release the button to drop it. Initiating combat will also cause you to automatically drop a held item. Grab the key artifacts scattered around the cavern and ask Bugenhagen to inspect them. Circulates through the body, slowing the wounded until they are completely turned to stone. Mmm. I forgot how his dad got turned to stone. I guess that was how. There's nothing else in here, guys. Oh, yes, there is. I can climb the walls. Derp. Excuse me, where did the remnant of our struggles and desires go? Did it did it respawn at the top? No. Yes. Just say fucking we. Let's stop using the ability because this guy seems like he's not fucking around. Ow. Alright, fine. Could use a heal anyway. Are you reflecting my bullets back at me? He'll be 40 HP. That specter you fought was a fallen key. How the fuck did you get up there, old man? Even in death, their lingering enmity manifests as such. They who wander in search of retribution. That's kind of pathetic. Do not be so quick to denigrate your enemies. 
nor make light of their plight. Consider <clears throat> this statue. It has been placed in this chamber for a reason. Handle it with the utmost care. I will. Deliver unto us the remnants of our past. Am I supposed to take this thing with us? I am, right? Maybe not. A watcher's work is never done. What the fuck, Red? I don't like it. It's like it's somebody else. And one could argue that everything has no reason. What? No, nobody could argue. That's stu That's the stupidest thing I've ever heard, old man. No. Try uh. placing a statue on one of the altars. Okay. What statue? Deliver unto us the remnants of our past. Restore them to their rightful place. Is it a color thing? Did I just get lucky? I'm right here, dude. Chill, you're very clingy right now. I don't like that. Fear me!
Let's shake a leg. Who the fuck are you? You're not red. Drop it. Drop it. Okay, get these. Oh shit, no, 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 no. Get back up. Emerald. Which one of these looks emerald? Oh, this one's lit up nicer, right? So it's this one, right? Oh, is it this one? God damn you, Red. Oh, god damn it. Well, is it not this one? Oh, that one already has a fucking... Okay. Okay, I got it, I got it. This game so far has been very accommodating of colorblindness, but uh, I don't see any indication outside of a color on these things. We need the ruby statue. Wait a minute, I thought there was another path. Oh. Yeah. Is that a materia? Pick up the materia red. What the hell? This is just a dead end? It can't be right. Oh, this is just for the materia, isn't it? Okay. Well then... So this is all... Uh... Oh, oh, look at all this. Okay, alright. Wait, isn't that the way we came from, though? The ruby statue? Oh, was I supposed to carry that one back with me? Oh, shit. The Chamber of Folly is right. I don't know what the hell I'm doing here. What? Where, the, where did y'all come from? Have I not been here? 
Is this not the way we came from? It definitely is. First came to these lands many millennia ago. This sanctuary is proof of their position. I didn't realize this thing trial was gonna be this involved. But if they were sealed away thousands of years ago, how'd they break out and attack the veil? That I cannot answer. Only the key themselves could. But enough about them. You are here to learn about yourself, Nanaki. This cave serves as a boundary between our world and that of the Gi. It was vital to them and their plans. Were the Gi to seize control of it, the canyon would be doomed. And the people. When the Gi moved against us yet again, a certain watcher recalled this vulnerability. Huh? Your dad. His time was of the essence. He entered the cave without reinforcements. As he had feared, it was teeming with Gi, ready to descend upon the village. Determined to protect the veil, he pounced from one foe to the next, felling all who dared oppose him. Hold on. If there was a watcher who single-handedly saved the canyon, how come I've never heard of them? <laughs> For now, you should focus on your own struggles with the Gi. Their malice grows more potent. Um, I'm gonna stop here. I'm gonna stop right here. And we will pick this up on the next one. 45 hours in, Jesus Christ. All right, we'll finish uh, chapter 10 tomorrow. Cool, see you then, appreciate you.